our storm coverage, we turn to Kimberly Richardson, who's live in Bronxville, Westchester County. Kimberly. Well, Lucy, here in Westchester, the rain and the wind, it was fast and furious, and it came in waves. Now, all of that water is one thing. Trees, that's an entirely different story. When it rained, oh, did it pour. Driving here in Westchester County was treacherous. So much water fell in such a short period of time. At one point, crews had to shut down this stretch of the Taconic Parkway in Hawthorne. Here in Hastings on Hudson, a much bigger problem. Oh my God, my, it, everything was destroyed. It looks like a war zone. Joanne's home here on Stanley Avenue, it was not damaged, but several towering trees in her yard. Once the storm blew through, it looked like a game of pickup sticks. With power now out, Joanne and her husband Michael left. I spoke with the couple by phone. It went left, right, and in the middle. And in the middle. It split three ways. Are you guys busy this morning with these storms? We're pretty busy, yes. We have another crew out in Corla Manor. But this was the first stop of the morning for Walter and his crew from Soto's Tree Service. This is a mess. It's a total of four trees, big oak trees that came down. Three big trees and then one was small that fell. Split and fell, taking down power lines and fences. This gigantic tree blocked the road. Branches landed on a neighbor's roof and cracked their front window. And I had one trunk removed at one point. I was always made me nervous in the yard, but I, there must have been something that ripped through for it to come out. Like, like the roots are out. The family was not here this week and had planned to be away for a few days because the home is on the market and today was the open house. One total loss in their backyard, their treasured tree house. Here is a before and after. My dad built it for them and my uncle years ago, and they love that tree house. And because Joanne and her family were not home at the time, they were not injured. Her neighbors are also okay. As for those trees, they miss hitting her home, which again is on the market by only about 15 feet.